Hi everybody, welcome back to another video. Um, I'm sorry if I look red and tired and hot. <laughs> I've been out shopping all day. I went to Costco and got toilet paper and paper towels because I was in out. Um, maybe I'll insert some clips because I did get some today. Um, they're from my view because I haven't had anyone film, but I did get some, so maybe I will insert those. Um, and then we went to Winco and did our normal long shopping day. So I am very hot, and I've waited all day to open this because I got it this morning. Well, I probably got it yesterday because the mail comes late, but I got the mail this morning, so I saw I got my new pull strap. Um, this is from um, Miley and Teddy. I will, of course, leave their YouTube and their Instagram and links below. Um, and so she makes pull straps. She does some uh, vests and things like that, but I just got a pull strap from her. Actually, I forgot to get my other rest. Um, obviously I'm not going to show the other side because it has our information on it, but she did say thank you on the package, which is really adorable, and I really like that. Um, she's, if you don't know who she is, she's basically my adopted sister in the community. I have totally adopted her as my sister. <laughs> um, I don't have any sisters that, like, I really know. I have half-sisters, but I wasn't raised or only met them when I once when I was 10. Um, so I don't really have any sisters, so I just kind of adopted her as my service dog sister, or service dog handler sister, if that makes sense. So she's my adopted sister. <laughs> I've claimed her. Um, but anyway, so it's really awesome that she makes pull straps because I'm not creative like she is, and I can't make anything to save my life. I'm not artistic. So let's get to the unboxing. I might actually not even need the stickers on this one. Oh, what is that? What is that? Okay, well, let's see. I don't want to accidentally use the scissors and cut it, but I also don't really want to use a knife and cut myself, so. <laughs> let's see. Right here. Here, come on, they can't see me. Come that way. They can't see me. I know. Is Mama opening things again? Oh, there we go. This has a little, like, thing I can use for it. I'm going to have to blur that out because I'm pretty sure that was showing the information. <laughs> it's hard to hide those. Um, I would have blacked it out with Sharpie, but I didn't, couldn't find one. But good thing my editor has a great... Come on, they can't see it! <laughs> um, good thing my editor has a great thing that I can use for that. I love Filmora. This is it. Thank you. She put this adorable... Um, Adorable, oh, yep, he can smell it. Adorable, uh, wrapping paper. And, of course, he smells the goodies. Oh, that was so sweet of her to include some goodies for you, Patches. Want to try one on camera? Let's see. Yeah, of course I do. Here you go. Okay, I'm going to take that over here, Mom. <laughs> oh, I got my new rug. You guys can barely see it, but I did. It's adorable. So here's the pull strap. Oh, it's really nice. I love it. I got it in red to match my um, Disney themed um, cape. If you're wondering, probably no one is. Um, it's long, much longer than my other one. If you don't know, my other one really didn't work for me. It was way too short. I didn't know that when I got it, it was my first pull strap and I didn't even have his harness yet. So I wasn't able to actually properly measure it. Um, but also it was only the only size that really came in. Um, again, I have to get my laptop on. <laughs> and so, I love this purple. She must know purple is my favorite color, hence the purple harness. <laughs> so, I love that. I'll probably actually save that, but I'll put it back in here for now. Um, it's really good quality. It's like really, um, what's the right word? It's really tough. Like, I could feel like I could pull on this a lot and it would not... <laughs> It would not budge. It's not like stretchy. I've actually never, if you don't know, I've never had a pair of cooler pull strap because this is the only one I've had, which does not, is not the right size for me at all with the vest he has. Um, this would probably be fine if it was a different kind of style vest, but because of the one I have, it does not work. It's way too short. Um, so much different. <laughs> um, but this is the only kind I've had, which is made from like fabric. Um, so I really am happy that I have an actual paracord one. I'm going to take off his cape for a minute so I can show you guys it on his harness. Of course, I am going to get a red harness. Um, I already ordered it actually, so it should be here soon. So stay tuned to this channel. Um, but I'm going to take that off for now. 
See how close the red matches? Yes, that's perfect. It matches my cape beautifully. <laughs> it's so Disney-like. Um, let me put it on this. I'm gonna take off all this stuff. Last video, I was a little more prepared. I had everything um, taken off, but I waited all day to do this. <laughs> and so this time, I'm just like, finally, we can do it. <laughs> so I'm not very prepared, am I? Is that the pole shop? He's like, oh, is it a toy for me? Um, so I'm gonna try and do this the way you're technically supposed to with this harness. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna put it through the little like stabilizer things because see on this harness you're supposed to put it through these little like stabilizers, um, so that way it doesn't come up like this little. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's like a little uh, like this little thing, um, and then attach it to here so it pulls the pressure right, which they'll be attached to there. That's how come it has to be longer because that's like almost in the front of him, and so that's how come it has to be longer because it has a wild. A ways to go. I don't know if I'm gonna like it through the stabilizers things. I don't know what they're actually called. But I don't know if I'm gonna like that or not. <laughs> yes! Okay, let's see. Let's get dressed. Hold up! Yeah, let's see. I actually might put leave it through there. I actually like it. Come here. Because um, I wasn't quite sure, but because of where the clips are, that actually works perfect. It is long, but I like him, like, when he's pulling me, I, like, I do like him, aww. I do like him a bit in front of me, rather than, like, this one where he was way too, like, he could not really, like, just me holding it was basically pulling, <laughs> so, um, so I like him to be a little bit more in front of me, especially when he's doing, like, guiding stuff. My feet itchy. And so I do like that, and when I'm standing up, let's see if I can show you guys. Um, but when I'm standing up, I feel like it's probably going to, we've had a long day, so he's so sleepy. Come on up! Um, you know, I'm just going to reach. Yeah, see, so it has to reach up to me, which he's like half my size about. Come stand! Um, he's about half my size, so that's going to actually be perfect. <laughs> he's tired, so I'm not making him do much of anything. Um, but that's really perfect. It looks long on him, and I'm well aware it looks long on him, but... He's about half my size, so when I'm holding it, it's going to go up a little bit more. And then for him to pull me, like, with momentum and guiding tasks and things like that, it's really the perfect size for me. Um, it's just kind of a preference thing. Like, he's big enough, he's tall enough to do mobility for me. He's heavy enough to do mobility for me, um, like the stuff I need. Um, so I just, it's one of those things, I just prefer, like if it was a handle, I wouldn't necessarily want it that long because long handles can be dangerous if you're pushing down on them. But for like a pull strap, that's really good, especially when he is working off, off, off leash, which he does a lot for my disabilities. That would be nice because if I need momentum, instead of just keeping his leash on all the time, like I normally wrap it around his medicine bag, but I'll just be able to grab that if I do need momentum rather than... I don't use this leash for that anyway, I use this, but this is too small, so normally I would just kind of grab his leash and he would pull me with this, but I have to hold his leash so that way, I don't know where this is going, <laughs> I just always feel like because this is too small, it's not as easy for me to grab when I need it, whereas this, the minute I need momentum, it'll be so much easier for me to like reach down and grab it, rather than this, um, don't want my laptop today. Rather than this, where um, I couldn't really do it that fast, so if I needed it, I'd have to grab his leash and then this. Um, it's hard to explain, and I know I'm not doing it right. Again, it's been a long day. But this will be just so much better. I won't always need to keep his leash on him when he is working off leash for my disabilities. <laughs> he wants to tell you. <laughs> Belly rub. I've been working good all day today. So I know it looks long, but considering that, you know, he comes up to, like, my waist, and, um, and where I like him to pull me, it's actually the perfect size for me. And because of my pain, it's much easier for him to be farther in front of me rather than closer to me when he is doing momentum stuff. Good boy. When he is doing momentum stuff, it's really easier for him to be farther ahead rather than with me. Because when he's with me, I'm having to use more of my back muscles, which hurt, which hurts a lot. And so this way, I'll just be able to relax and casually hold it rather than have to be like you know, using all those muscles back there, which cause pain. So it'll be really good for a lot of reasons. I hope I explained everything right. It's been a really long day and I'm tired. I just ate lunch <laughs> a minute ago. 
at McDonald's, if anyone's wondering. But I really love it. That is perfect. It will go so well with his cape. I'm not going to buckle it on. Oh, you guys can't see it. But yeah, it goes really good with the cape. The color's right. Um, when I get his red harness, which is, should be coming soon, she, his gear maker just messaged me. She was ordering like the fabric to do everything. So it should be coming soon. And then after I get that one, I'm ordering one to go with his Harry Potter one. So stay tuned to this YouTube channel because I should have a lot of gear unboxings. Um, I actually like it through the stabilizers. I didn't think I would, but because of it being the right size, it's actually perfect. So I really like it. Um, I didn't take into account the buckles when I measured it. That was my fault. Um, not taking it into account like where the buckles would be on it, but it fits perfect still. So um, it's kind of nice because these nice buckles um, are the this part are. <laughs> Let me see, wait, I'm just messing up my words. Um, the buckles are like where the stabilizer part is, which is really nice because then it's like buckle and then it goes through the stabilizer and it's the pull strap. So it's really nice. I love it so much. She, Miley did a great job. Thank you, Miley. Um, she was really talented with making vests and pull straps and by the time she's 18, she could have her own company building this stuff. This paracord one's really so nice. Like this one didn't really, this cloth one, because it's soft and all. But it's not like sensory like this is. So I really like it. It's really nice. She did a great job with it. It's really good quality. Um, I'm so excited that I ordered from her. And it's really cheap too. Like if you want a pull strap, she's your girl. Because she sells them for really good prices. So. <laughs> good boy. Okay. What is this? Or just sit there. There you go. Here's your biscuit. <laughs> okay. So she did an excellent job with it. I love it so much. It's really good quality. Um, I really like the texture of it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a little distracted by this texture because it's a really good texture. It's like, it's paracord feels really like, um, not stretchy, like it's not supposed to be, but I don't know how to describe it. It just feels really good quality. So she did a great job with it and I really love it. Um, I can't wait until I get my red harness now because all my stuff is just going to come together and look so nice on it. And I'm so excited. <laughs> and I'll probably just keep this one on uh, the purple harness when I get the red one and put the red one on it. Although I probably won't reuse this one again because it just does not work. Like, it's cute, but it just doesn't work. It doesn't have a good texture. It's way too short. Like, way too short for me. Um, but yeah, so this is nice. And again, another reason the long ones will be nice for me. I hope I'm not repeating myself too much. Sorry if I am. But another reason it will be nice is because, again, when he is working off leash for my disabilities, I feel like I'll just be able to take off the leash entirely and use the full, like, if I need him to do momentum or something. Um, because obviously I wouldn't need to grab it for any reason because he's perfect off leash, like an off leash service like should be. But I feel like if I needed, <laughs> you're looking for more treats. Um, but I feel like, like with the leash, I always just kind of keep it wrapped around his thing just in case like there was an emergency for an example and I had to like leash him up really quick like if there was a fire or something um he's been through fire alarms so that's excellent but he you know if there was an active fire there might that might be a reason I had to grab him like even with off leash service like you should always have a leash for an emergency but I feel like this could act as a leash in an emergency if I didn't actually have his leash so that's great I really love it it's really good quality um it's perfect for me um, I know it looks long, but it's really perfect for us. Um, I feel like I'm just going to get a lot of problems on that. But because of the shape of his harness, because of my height and his height and my height of my arms and the tasks I need it for and preventing pain and emergencies, <laughs> I just feel like it's perfect. Um, so it's great quality and I love it so much. Um, I'm excited to uh, get to use it. I waited all day to open it and I really wanted to use it today because it would have been helpful, but... I wanted to wait until I could film a video. So I think that's it. Um, I love it so much. And so I guess that's it. Thank you so much, Miley and Teddy. And their socials again are down below. So please like, comment, subscribe. Do all the things. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys. <laughs> Couldn't remember which side my thing was on. Hello everyone, thanks for visiting my channel at Officially Lady is Life. Um, please like, subscribe, turn on this bell notifications, and leave a nice comment if you have something to say. Thanks, bye.